We are in London's South Bank by the Thames. It's kind of a street photography hotspot. You've got all of this lovely concrete and great light. This is where I get a lot of my work. A large part of my style is using shape and contrast. Trying to make some sort of interesting moment out of everyday scenes. That's the whole ethos of street photography, making extraordinary out of the ordinary. I didn't plan for that bird to fly over, but I'm looking for an environment first, and then I'm waiting for a subject to interact with it. Seeing how phones are catching up to proper cameras, shooting in RAW, having that function. It's been great to use. Leica lenses do have a quality to them that is special. They revolutionized photojournalism. It's a brand synonymous with great photography. Black and white photography is about texture, space, shape, light. The sensor is like the brain of the camera and the, the lens is like the eye. The better the eye, the better the images that can be recorded. Being able to dial in exposure compensation and shutter speed by just touching on the phone, it's a nice way of working. I really see photography as the opportunity to show people the world in a way that we don't always observe it. Perspective and camera placement are really important parts of my style. I actually ended up flipping the phone upside down. Without that, I wouldn't have been able to force such a strong geometric pattern. I've made 10 images that we're going to put out to the public. Photography in my style, really, kind of abstract, minimalist scenes. A phone can allow people to express themselves and to get their ideas out there. It's closing the gap to mirrorless and DSLR cameras, showing how far the phones have come. Whether you're a beginner or a professional and you want to tap into those more detailed sides of photography. Street photography is a way of seeing the world and interacting with the world and it's a kind of a way of life. I just love it. Water can be a really beautiful detail and contrast in black and white photographies. I was able to manually select 4,000th of a second as a shutter speed to give it that kind of wall effect. It's about forcing the viewer to engage with a different perspective. I like trying to be creative using as little as possible. You just need the camera, a good eye, and anything's possible.